بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم فرینڈز آئی ایم ارشد خان آج تک اینڈ یو آر واچنگ چینل تجسس فورم ٹوڈے اور ٹاپک از ناؤن اوکے ناؤن از دا فرسٹ پارٹ آف دا لسٹ آف پارٹس آف اسپیچ اوکے ناؤن از اے ورڈ دیٹ از یوز فار نیمنگ پرپسز اوکے وی کین سے ان ڈیٹیل دیٹ ناؤن از دا نیم آف پرسن پلیس تھنگ اینیمل ایکشن ایکسپریشن ایٹسیٹرا اوکے ناؤن ہیز بیسکلی الیون ٹائپس اوکے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو الیبوریٹ and discuss them in detail one by one okay look common noun common noun is a noun which refers to things in general okay and this we actually don't target someone specifically okay this refers to general things for example if i say boy girl city okay now these are common nouns because this doesn't tell us about a specific person or a specific place okay now coming towards the proper noun these same nouns can be turned into proper if we specify a thing okay for example if i say ali instead of boy okay now each and every boy surely can't be called ali okay ali will be a specific boy so now in case when i use the word ali this noun is now proper okay Similarly, if I say Shehla Now surely each and every girl can't be Shehla Shehla refers to a specific girl So now Shehla can't be called a common noun, okay? Shehla is basically a proper noun Okay, now if I say Peshawar So each and every city cannot be Peshawar Okay, Peshawar is the name of a specific place so Peshawar is a proper noun okay this was the difference between a common and a proper noun okay so I hope you will have got it now coming towards the abstract and concrete noun these are opposite to one another okay abstract noun means the noun of things that you can't touch that don't have a physical body okay for example love hate fear happiness danger okay all these nouns are abstract nouns on the other hand concrete noun is the noun of things that you can physically touch that hold bodies okay for example building chair table bed etc okay okay coming towards compound noun compound noun is actually a noun that is composed basically of two words but that is written as a single word and is spoken and used as a single word okay for example policeman class fellow etc okay collective noun is the noun which refers to a group for example family class etc okay countable noun is the noun of things that you can count in numbers okay for example in one two three for example one marker two markers three markers one chair, two chairs, three chairs, etc. Okay. On the other hand, uncountable nouns are the names of things that is impossible to count in one, two, three. Okay. Instead, we can use specific units for their measurement, like for example, letter, kilograms, etc. Okay. The examples of uncountable noun includes water, honey, milk, air, etc. Okay. The next pair of noun consists of nouns singular and plural. Singular noun refers to thing that is only one in number, while plural noun refers to things that are more than one in numbers, okay? For example, if boy refers to one person and another hand boys refers to more than one person then boy is a singular noun and boys is a plural noun okay similarly chair is a singular noun while its plural is chairs okay etc now finally coming towards the last one kind of noun that is material noun material noun refers to the names of materials of which things are composed okay for example wood uh, steel plastic cement etc okay okay see you in next video till that goodbye